This film is so stupid. Just stick with it. So confused. The whole film is backwards. Yeah, ass backwards. I shouldn't have to use my brain like this. I've never watched The Fast and Furious and thought, oh, this film makes too much sense. Try playing it in reverse. What? That 80s rock music. You hear it and you're like, what is this? And then you play it in reverse and you're like, oh, it's a message from Satan. Is it so hard to write a film with a simple beginning, middle, and uh, what's the end bit called? The end. Yeah, what's it called? Is that Mike from Neighbours? Well, good day, mate. Is that, um, um, ah, oh, uh, Carry on Moss. No. Trinity from The Matrix. He's in The Matrix too. Oh, I get it now. The whole film takes place inside The Matrix. The Matrix and Memento, they're two different films. Set in the same cinematic universe, like Batman and Spider-Man. So when does Keanu show up? Oh, it's like watching a student film. It's Christopher Nolan. I don't know what that is. He wrote the Dark Knight trilogy. So it is part of the multiverse. If it's not in The Matrix, why has it got all the same characters? It's not got the same characters, it's got the same actors. Why has it got all the same actors then? Maybe they had the same casting director. Or? It's a glitch in the Matrix. I, I'm, I'm not watching with you anymore. Okay, but serious question. How do we know we're not in the Matrix? Because the Matrix is a film and... Surprised to see me, Mr. Patel. Oh, it's like watching a student film.